Hey, Warren. Welcome to Edmonton. Hi. Could you take us uh, through this past season with Carolina? And, w- like, was there anything that led you to believe a, a trade was was maybe coming at some point? Um, you know, first off, I I, uh, I loved my time in Carolina. Um, we had a great group of guys, and um, we had a great coach in Rod Brindamore. And, um, you know, we had a good team, and we, and we fell short in the playoffs. Um but uh, at the end of the year, like we had some honest conversations with each other and um, y- y- you never know what, what's going to happen next. But um, all I do know is that I'm extremely thrilled to, uh, to be with the Oilers. Okay. So, you know, we've seen a, a little bit uh, of you. How do you describe yourself as a, pl- as a player? Like pretty, I know there's some pretty respectable stats. I think there was a story a couple of years ago that you were leading the NHL in penalties drawn uh, for a while. I don't know if you saw that stuff, uh, but, but tell, how would you describe yourself? Uh, I think I'm just a tenacious 200 foot player. Um, I try to use my speed to, uh, you know, take pucks to the net, draw penalties and, um, you know, I, I like to play a hard-nosed game and, and you know, be reliable on, uh, on, on the defensive zone as well. Next question. Thanks. Next question, Derek Van Deese, Post Media. Hey, Warren. Welcome to Edmonton. Um, from the outside looking in, it looked like that Carolina group was a pretty fun team to be around to play with, I guess. Was it, was it as fun as it looked, uh, you know, just with everything going on in Carolina and just uh, with everything there? Yeah, it, it was a great, great locker room, um, great staff. And, um, you know, it, it's a, it's a little bit bittersweet, uh, today, but uh, I'm, I'm extremely happy, uh, you know, to, to be with the Oilers. Now you're coming to Edmonton, you're playing, you know, two of the best players in the league and in, in Connor McDavid and Leon Dreisaitl, I guess, how much did you get to see them last year and how excited are you to, to kind of join that group with them? Oh, obviously with the, the pandemic, didn't really see them last year, but playing them the year before, um, you know, they're, they're two of the best players in the league. And um, I train with, uh, with Connor and now there, it looks like there's five of us um, from the Oilers that are training together now. So, um, you know, they got an exciting team and, you know, I'm just, just ready to uh, contribute wherever that is. Now you put up pretty good numbers last year, uh, I guess in 2019, 2020 with 30 points. You think uh, there's still more offensive in you, especially since you're coming now and, and playing with some pretty high dynamic offensive players. Yeah. You know, I'm just trying to get better every year. I think that's the goal um, as a player that you, you, you get more comfortable in the league and, you know, you're just trying to get better. Um, and I think one of my strengths is uh, producing five on five and um, you know, like I said before, I think I'm a tenacious player and um, I always work hard. And those are things that, uh, that have made me uh, successful so far. And last one for me, just uh, have you had a chance to talk to, to either the GM or the coach here in Edmonton about how they plan to utilize you? Uh, I, I briefly talked to Ken, um, just welcoming to the team and, um, you know, stuff like that. But no, nothing, nothing about that kind of stuff. But uh, just extremely excited to, uh, to be here. Thanks, Warren. Looking forward to seeing you. Next question, Paul Gazzola, Oilers TV. Hey, Warren. Congratulations on joining the Oilers. Um, you've obviously had some success in the postseason with Carolina. I'm just wondering um, how you're looking to bring that success over to Edmonton in the playoffs as well. Yeah, you know, playoff hockey is it's, it's a fun, uh, fun game and the goal is to win. And I think I'm a pretty competitive guy to begin with. And you know, uh, it's just those moments that it kind of brings the best out of you. And for me, it's just, it's just pl- playing the same way, playing hard, um, using my feet. And, you know, uh, it's a little bit tighter playing playoff hockey than the regular season. And, and that's something that I, I feel that that helps me out there. And just, can you elaborate a little bit on um, training with a lot of the Oilers? Like uh, who specifically are you training with and how much does that make you feel a little bit comfortable coming into the locker room? Yeah, um, there's, uh, there's Connor, um, Darnell, uh, Hyman now, and uh, Devin Shore. So it's definitely exciting to, you know, have some familiar faces to, uh, to, 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 to be with once I get down there to Edmonton. And um, yeah, it's, it's been a crazy day. And it's funny, I, I was on the ice when it happened. So a bunch of the guys that I knew and 
um, when I got off the ice, uh, uh, Shores, he uh, pulled up his phone and he's like, he's like, you're, you're here. And I, and I was like, what do you mean? And so it was pretty, uh, pretty crazy day. And it, it's been a lot of fun.